Alrighty, guys. It is Friday, the 11th of March. We're going to be tackling Airflow by Hitchy. This track looks... This track looks like my style. I'm not saying... I, I want to be clear that I'm not saying that this... Uh, uh, that I think that any stealing was happening. No, no, no. I don't even want to suggest that. Um... I feel like saying it has suggested that, but I don't want to suggest that. This looks really cool, and I'm excited. Oops. This, look, this, this looks like the style I like to map in, so... It means, to me, it'll be really fun. Okay, is this speed tech, or is this, like, full speed? Guess we'll find out. The grass makes me think that it's going to be, that it's full speed, or at least, oh boy, oh, I'm going to fly off, alright, let's continue, it's just really high speed grass, that I'm personally a fan of, okay, that turns a little weird, but I'll get it. Little brake tab just to make sure I actually make it. You probably can do some speed slides on this track due to how kind of open and... It's just how open this track is. Uh, I missed the checkpoint. Oh, wait, no, that, I don't think that was a checkpoint. Okay, I cannot go too wide. I have to be very quite close to the inside to make that without breaking. Uh, okay. Now, I understand why that's there, though, because... Oh, boy. Is it pretty needed to go in where that is, where, that, where that's pointing? Okay. Speed sliding there may be a bad idea because I line myself up horribly. Can do a little bit of speed sliding though. Okay, that's it's gonna be a difficult track to do without breaking in some capacity. It's definitely not the same as my style. I don't. It, it just looked like it. This is definitely this is definitely a unique style. Now that I'm seeing it, not that I would care if someone took my style because. <laughs> I basically saw I basically saw a ski freak style and was like, I really like that. Let me try to do that. And took my own take on ski freak style, so thievery uh, thievery is the best form of flattery. Okay, that was not gonna end well. Um, speed going. Oh boy, don't crash into that pole. That'd be a good idea. I will say that uh, on a side, on an unrelated side note, my my newest track, uh, Verdant Grasslands, uh, was played today, or well, as of the recording, as of the upload date, it was played yesterday, and the. The North American back pot potluck 
which is really cool. Unfortunately, I was out of my computer to play it at the time, but really cool. I'm, I always love... I mean, the potluck, it's not like I have to submit and hope to get in. They take whatever track you give them, which is super cool. But uh, it gives my track some exposure. I've put a few tracks in that potluck. You uh, are in the North American Discord. Uh, keep an eye out, I guess, in the potluck. Anytime I make a new track, I generally put it in there. worried about flying off. I was about to say, I gotta be careful to not lose too much speed on it, but flying off is much worse than losing too much speed. Oh my god, I'm trying too hard to speed slide when I don't need to, and, I, and it, it makes the line weird if I do. Touched. Dude, that's unfortunate. Oh my god. Of course. I'd like to finish this track. We're getting close to seven, maybe eight minutes in, and I have not yet completed the track. I don't even know how far in I am. I'm trying too hard to be fast. And I haven't even experienced the whole track yet. Okay, and then in this turn, just need to kind of accept the speed loss. And I need to come from way on the outside, which is kind of hard based on the previous turn. But it's, it's, it's what needs to be done. Oh, I crashed into the checkpoint indicator. mind. If I get past that turn smoothly, I will be able to take it to the end more than likely. I don't see myself messing up the rest of it. Please, I just want to do this first turn. We're about to be 10 minutes in without a single completion. All because I'm greedy. Didn't even try in that one. Oh, okay. Oh my 
god. Please. I just want to do it. I just want to make it so I can finish the track at least. I've only seen half of the track. It'd be nice to see the other half. Unfortunately, my desire to go fast is uh, taking me over. There's an easy speed slide to get that I can guarantee will happen. That's a good speed slide there, too. Dang it. I'm going to get a respawn on that. Dude, that corner is really difficult. Oh, thank God there are good, good respawns. I'm going to go there. I'm gonna I'm just gonna respawn to get it. So I'm gonna go here, hug you tight around that. I see the finish. There's magnets, thank god. Oh, I see the, the risky. It's a huge ring, by the way. Okay. We we did it. Now let's actually Get this going. Uh, I pressed my buttons at the same time. I had a really good start. That I can say for certain. Whoa, that magnet worked really well. Okay, I'm... I don't want to worry about speed sliding on that turn. It causes me to go really wide when I don't need to. And there are other places where a speed slide is easy to do and I don't have to worry about it. speed. It's just not... I did the same freaking thing. I was about to say, let's just not crash into the, t to the road piece. It's going to be common for me to crash into that. Oh boy. Too slow. Maybe a track that I turn off and go. I missed the checkpoint. The great thing about that turn that I missed the checkpoint on is I pretty much can just hold my like 75% bind and be in like the perfect speed slide the whole way through. Same with this one, honestly. Ooh, I got a bit of air. That was not good. I'm gonna break there because I wanna play it safe. Oh my god, that turn is hard. At least at the angle that I took it at. Okay, 
big speed. Don't even touch the magnet, really, if I speed slide good enough. Dude, I'm so good at hitting that edge. I don't know what about this track makes me want to just play ultra risky, but something about this track makes me play ultra risky. I'm gonna miss the checkpoint. I can continue the track, but uh, this run is dead. I don't need to look at my skid marks once I, like, know that I'm going to get into the speed slide, so I should not worry about it. See, there, I was looking at exactly where I was going. Huge speed. Don't fly off. Oh, my God. I was too far on the inside this time. Oh my god. Oh, dang it. Come on. Man. We're freaking 17 minutes in and I've completed the track one time. All because I like to go really risky. Okay. Getting the speed slide and then I can just look. Not the greatest. Oh my god, I almost slid out. I slid off. That turn is really hard. Smooth. It was a good run, and all good things must come to an end in me crashing into that wall. Because of course. Very good. I'm gonna fly off. No, dude. Those two corners, the corner just there and the corner right after it are my like Achilles heel. The rest of it isn't even that hard. Now that I know what's there, like literally the rest of it isn't even that hard. I'm sitting here 20 minutes in with one completion. Really, there's something about it that my brain finds difficult. The amount of magnet I touch in that section indicates how well I did the speed slides before. No, I wanted to be further to the left because the last time I was too far to the right and didn't and had problems with the magnet. Now I'm in the opposite. I was too far to the left. I'm surprised I made that. Yeah, 
I touched way less magna that time. A good speed slide. And then I just was greedy. Twenty minutes in. I only have a bronze on this track. Pretty sad. At least for my own ability. Okay, there's a speed slide, it was okay. That time I was way too far to the right. Because that turn specifically is ridiculously hard. When I go out on that turn, I understand why. The challenge of that turn I've not yet fully grasped. Any of the rest of the parts, it's kind of just me being too greedy. I'll hit the brake. I did it again. If I can get past that, like, outside turn, I, I feel like I could probably set a good time. minutes. Canada spends 30 minutes on one track, completing it only once, needing a respawn, and then spends the rest of his time being way too greedy for his own self, and is unable to complete a run in another, in this, in, in the amount of time just because of it. How dare I? There it is. An actually good run. He says as he's only ninth. It's actually quite concerning. There's seven minutes left and I'm ninth in PA. Recording this later than I would, so after I do this, I'm just gonna immediately grab the replays. So, whatever position I get here is whatever position I get. I may not be in the end of replay. Let's see. Clearly, there's like a lot of speed that I'm missing. done that better. And crash. Good speed. 
speed. Also good speed. This is probably the turn I'm most lo losing the most speed on. I'm getting out air all over the place. Okay, there's barely any improvement. Barely any improvement, we got three minutes left. I want to think that there's a shortcut, but I, I, I doubt it. With how fast and open this track is, I feel like there's not a possibility of a uh, a cut, or at least there's less of a possibility of a cut. Let me say that. speed slide. Okay. All right. That's how we're playing in this game. I only have a few more runs in me because of the time limit. We'll see. I bet you, here's how I, here's how I, I'm, I'm not going to look at the replays. I bet you the reason why I'm, I'm losing time is because somehow, some way, um, not sliding is probably the fastest. Like NASCARing all the turns, probably the fastest. There's half a second of improvement, so at least it's not too bad. Okay. Well, I don't have any more time for today, so I will see you all tomorrow. Actually, I'll see you all on Sunday. We will attack whatever track happens to be the track of the day for today. Um, until then, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the rest of your day. That was my steam. And I will see you all after this run. You will get some more improvement. I don't think so, but maybe. Well, we can try. Ooh, nope. Later.